नमस्कार आप देख रहे हैं मेट्रो मॉर्निंग और मैं हूं आपके साथ श्वेता सिंह इस बुलेटिन की शुरुआत कर लेते हैं चंद्रयान तीन से जुड़ी खबर के साथ जी हां आज भारत इतिहास रचने से महज कुछ घंटों की दूरी पर है अंतरिक्ष यान लॉक और लोड हो चुका है और अब से कुछ ही घंटों में चंद्रयान तीन श्रीहरिकोटा के सतीश धवन अंतरिक्ष केंद्र से उड़ान भरेगा लॉन्च होगा अंतरिक्ष यान आज दोपहर दो बजकर पैंतीस मिनट पर उड़ान भरने वाला है यह कैसा क्षण है जिसका भारत पिछले चार सालों से इंतजार कर रहा है चंद्रमा पर भारत की तीसरे मिशन का लक्ष्य असंभव को संभव कर दिखाना है So it will reach around Earth. Then it will travel towards Moon slowly over the next one month. Then uh, we are hoping that everything is all right. Then it will reach and land on the Moon on August 23rd onwards any day. और सीधे रुक कर लेते हैं हमारी सहयोगी धरणी का जो इस वक्त आपको बता दें श्री हरिकोटा के सतीश धवन स्पेस सेंटर से इस वक्त हमारे साथ लाइव जुड़ गई हैं धरणी वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू यू इंडिया इज रेडी टू क्रिएट हिस्ट्री इम्पॉसिबल को पॉसिबल कर दिखाना है इसरो इज रेडी Uh, this is India's third lunar mission and second attempt to make a soft landing on the moon. Remember, for the first time in uh, October 2008, Chandrayaan-1 was launched and it remained functional till August 2009. And Chandrayaan-1 made the most important. important uh, you know his uh, invention in the history of uh, uh, the human kind as far as space sector is concerned it confirmed the presence of water molecules on the surface of the moon and then later in 2019 chandrayaan 2 was launched but unfortunately during landing uh, the Ch uh, chandrayaan 2's lander uh, deviated from the planned trajectory and it made a crash landing on the lunar surface but still uh, the orbit of chandrayaan 2 it still continues to uh, function around the moon and it, it is providing data to uh, you know isro till date so uh, today the chandrayaan 3 it will be the third uh, third lunar mission of isro and its second attempt to make a soft landing you know uh, uh, on the moon uh, so today at around uh, 235 pm from the satish devan space center here in shrigadi kota a uh, chandrayaan 3 uh, will be launched in, into the sky and of course uh, in, in fact yesterday a team of scientists from isro uh, headed by uh, you know uh, uh, the chief uh, mr somnath they offered prayers at the uh, tirumala tirupati devasthanam in andhra pradesh uh, you know uh, uh, seeking uh, the blessings of the god the venkatachalapathi god there uh, you know uh, pray for a, a safer soft landing on the moon So talking about uh, this mission as I told this will be uh, ISRO's second attempt to make a soft landing on the moon and uh, you know Chandrayaan 3 will have a uh, three main uh, you know objects that is uh, you know it will have a propulsion module it will have a lander and a rover the lander's name is uh, uh, Vikram and the rover's name is Pragyan so uh, again uh, the three main objectives of Chandrayaan 3 mission is that to uh, to demonstrate a safe and a soft landing on the moon uh, to demonstrate uh, the rowing capabilities of the rover and to perform scientific experiments experiments in the south pole of the The moon. So, talking about the lander, uh, you know, uh, the lander's, uh, uh, you know, it, it has uh, the legs of the lander have been made, you know, more robust. And unlike Chandrayaan two, uh, which had five engines, Chandrayaan three uh, will only have a uh, four engines, and that will make it more stable. And we're also given to understand that, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, rigorous experiments of both the software and the hardware, you know, have been uh, made as far as Chandrayaan three is concerned. And uh, ISRO chief Somnath had told that uh, this new mission has been designed in such a way that even if certain elements fail, uh, the landing will still be successful. successful because you know in 2019 when chandrayaan 2 was launched the only problem we had uh, right. was during the landing except for the landing part every other aspect was successful in chandrayaan 2 uh, we only did a crash landing that's uh, because uh, uh, chandrayaan 2's lander deviated from its you know original trajectory but this time uh, isro has made sure that they have the landing part you know sorted so uh, we are expected to make a soft landing on the moon and if we do so uh, this will make india the fourth country country after india russia uh, after uh, pardon me after usa Uh, Russia and China are uh, to enter the light uh, you know uh, club of nations that have achieved this feat right adhani uh, bilkul bharat bhi ab uh, itihas mein apna naam darj karwana chahta hai aur falal adhani i would also uh, like to ask how is the josh outside shri harikota satish dhawan space center because i can see people around there Yeah. <laughs> 
Yes, definitely. The launch is only at you know 2:35 p.m. in the afternoon. But you know, uh, still, even now, like uh, from 6 a.m. in the morning, people have started coming to the Satish Dhawan Space Center here in Shrigiri Kota. Uh, there is a public uh, gallery over here where uh, you know thousands of people are expected to uh, you know sit in person and witness this uh, you know a massive uh, a feat that's going to be achieved by you know ISRO. So the launch, as I told, will happen around 2:35 p.m. But the public are allowed from the morning, and uh, those who have uh, you know uh, booked their uh, slots for the uh, public gallery. Uh, seats they will be coming to the Satish Dhawan Space Center one by one and in fact as I'm talking right now people have already started coming so definitely the mood is very uh, you know joyful and lively here in Shrigiri Kota in fact uh, uh, the team of ISRO scientists who have worked on Chandrayaan 3 uh, they've been you know staying at the Satish Dhawan uh, Space Center here for the last uh, you know few days to ensure I uh, you know uh, to ensure the launch setup is uh, uh, you know ready so uh, the launch setup is ready and in fact yesterday around 1 uh, you know 5 p.m. the countdown for the same had begun uh, so this will be at 24 uh, 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 24 hour and 30 minutes, uh, uh, 25 hour and 30 minutes countdown, and the countdown will end, uh, you know, uh, right by 2:35 p.m. I uh, know today where uh, when the launch will happen. So definitely the mood is very lively, and I uh, you know it looks very pleasant here over at the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Shrigiri Kota. The people have started coming, and I uh, you know uh, as time passes by, we can only expect more crowd, and we're also expecting more school students because you know uh, several uh, private and government schools from the states of Tamil Nadu, Karnataka, and you know Kerala, uh, they are bringing their children here, uh, you know. Uh, 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 you know, to Shrigiri Kota to witness this, uh, uh, you know, uh, Chandrayaan 3 launch because this is definitely a massive launch, a massive feat in, in, in India's, uh, you know, space sector. Uh, so definitely uh, we are expecting a lot of school and college uh, students also here to, uh, you know, to witness this. So definitely the mood will be lively and uh, uh, the weather also looks fine. There is no, uh, you know, there is no evidence of any rain or, you know, uh, uh, unpleasant weather conditions. The weather looks fine here. Uh, so we'll have to wait and see. In fact, uh, uh, we have a family sitting over right. here. We'll try, you know, talking to them. Uh, hi, sir. So uh, I I guess that you've come to the uh, uh, you know Chandrayaan yeah, three yeah, launch. Yeah. So you've uh, you know come with your kid here. Can you uh, share your excitement? Like uh, how you're feeling right now? Yeah, we are very excited and we are praying uh, to God that uh, this event to be this historic event to be very successful because this uh, make Indians proud throughout the world. So. We are very excited and we came in the morning and our kid, you know, uh, seeing first time uh, this launch. So, I am uh, praying. Thank you. So, it's definitely going to be a memorable day for the family because they have brought their kid over here. Right. This will be the first time that he is going to witness a rocket launch. And the first rocket a launch that he is going to witness itself is going to be Chandrayaan 3. So, definitely a memorable day for the family. And just like this family, we are expecting thousands of, you know, other families and other you know uh, students to also visit the uh, location here to witness this uh, uh, you know right, uh, this, uh, development in person राइट right, धरनी आपका बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया इन तमाम जानकारी के लिए और जब बात भारत के गौरव की हो तो निश्चित तौर पर एक रिपोर्टर के तौर पर बातें खत्म नहीं होती हैं और लोगों का ताता भी देखिए एक छोटा सा परिवार जो है छोटा सा बच्चा भी गवाह बनने के लिए श्रीहरिकोटा के स्पेस सेंटर पर इस वक्त पहुंच चुका है भारत का भविष्य कहे जाते हैं बच्चे ये है ये जब देखेंगे श्रीहरिकोटा से आज जब उड़ान भरेगा तो निश्चित तौर पर भारत का भविष्य कितनी ऊंचाई पर जाएगा ये बच्चे भी तय करेंगे फिलहाल धरनी आपका बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया इन तमाम जानकारी के लिए